Game theory um, is kind of related to economics a little bit. It's the study of basically any kind of strategic interaction between people um, in economics or business or just even social interactions. Um, so in game theory, um, you kind of assume that people are like exactly rational and exactly self-interested. So they're going to do exactly what's best for them. But what well, their outcome for themselves depends on the choices that other people make. Basically, like the question is, if you have a whole bunch of different computers, all of which have different speeds, and a whole bunch of different like jobs or tasks that need to get done on those computers, um, how do you assign them to the computers to take the least time overall? And we're assuming that like the more jobs you have assigned to one machine, the longer it takes all of those jobs. So what we're studying is, okay, well, if jobs are assigning themselves to machines, so like um, I'm going to be on the internet, I'm picking a server to download something from, I'm going to pick the one that's the fastest for me. Um, so one of the questions we're trying to answer is, okay, if everybody does that, how does the overall solution kind of compare to the best possible overall solution? This research is pretty theoretical, so there aren't, there aren't like direct applications. Um, but this kind of topic can be used in, a num in numerous ways. Um, like this is like a, an actual problem that people have to solve on like routing traffic along the internet or assigning jobs to machines on computers. It's just fun to be able to prove something brand new that nobody else has been able to prove before. And like unlike in most of classes in school um, where you're proving, like math classes where you're proving things, the results we're proving are brand new, like nobody has ever thought about this stuff before. And so it's really kind of a special experience to be able to prove something of your very own for the first time.